Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and uh, interesting um, tests that have been done. So uh, NeoWin has decided to test a few things uh, over the past few weeks and months and, and now about Windows 10, Windows 11, the performance of Windows 10 versus Windows 11, which they come to a conclusion is pretty much the same in most of the tests that they did. Yet... Something that's been popping up a lot, and I've seen some people talk about it. Um, when you're on Windows 11 22H2 and you move to Windows 11 23H2, uh, some people have noticed a slight performance decrease. And a lot of the decrease uh, seems to be from 5 to 8 percent ish. Um, so this is interesting. I personally have not seen really much difference, although a lot of gamers have actually said that they've seen games um, frame rate go um, lower since they are on 23H2. And what happens is that when they actually move to or move back to 22H2, it's back to normal. Uh, so this is interesting. Um, there seems to be something happening in 23H2. The guess that I have could be not with 23H2 itself. I wonder if that could actually mean more of a an actual uh, decrease because of some features that are implemented, including Copilot. So this is kind of interesting. I don't know. Um, I also will try something that caught my curiosity. While doing a little bit of research on Reddit, I've noticed that a lot of people are talking about Forza Horizon 5 being problematic on 23H2. And I will try it uh, in the next few hours. I'll play probably a little bit for an hour or two. Uh, and see if I notice anything new in terms of performance issues on my gaming laptop. Um, so, and there, of course, are a lot of people, gamers mostly, saying that they have a little more stuttering, so little freezes here and there of their gaming experience on 23H2, which was not on 22H2. And a few users say, well, you know, they decided, well, maybe it's because of the upgrade process, so they actually did a complete refresh reinstalling Windows 11 with 23H2 from scratch, and they say it's the same. Performance is not like 22H2. So uh, if you are out there, if you've moved from 22H2 on Windows 11 to 23H2, do you see any change in performance? And if you're a gamer, do you have any issues that have popped up? Uh, that'd be interesting to uh, know if you could uh, just Write this down in the comments below. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.